How's it going, everybody? In Life Teen episode 11, welcome. We hope you enjoy the vlog. Hey! by using political views, when really, we have to look at every single person as a person. And the church, if we do it through the church, the church gives us the tools. See, Jesus didn't come to form a political party. There is no political party that embraces everything that Jesus does. He didn't come and say, hey guys, become this, you know, part of this political party. He came and formed the church. And the church is in each and every single one of us. We are the church. The church is not that building standing right there. The church is us. He was, he's almighty God. He would have done it himself. He wanted to finish, say, capital punishment. He died condemned to death on the cross. He died of capital punishment. Even then, he didn't end it. He didn't say, you know what, I do not want capital punishment. Was it because he was not after all Almighty God? He came and formed the church. And then he instructed the church to look at one another like brothers and sisters. And he commanded us, commanded us. He didn't say, if you want to. He said, he said to Peter, do you love me? And Peter is like, yeah, 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 Jesus, I love you. He said, feed my sheep. Take care of them. Care for them. Who are the sheep? Is all of us. Well, I can tell you that if you are helpful at home and create an environment of love in your own home by supporting your parents, by helping them out in any way that, that you can as a teenager, your parents are going to be happier. And therefore, they're going to fight less between them. Because a lot of the fights that I have with my husband are, have something to do with my kids. Because every single thing that you do helps. Mother Teresa said when somebody came and told them, I want to be like you. I want to like do as much good as you do. She said, go back and love your family. Because that's where it all starts. Because we know that people who commit injustices, 
are people who are in love. And many times they were not loved at home. So if we can just take care of that, we already solve half of the problems of the world. Now the third one is rights and responsibilities as a Christian. So as a Christian, you have rights. You have the right to life above all. Something to be a good Christian and to bring you know, goodness and to bring God to their lives. The goal of the seven beasts is to promote human solidarity. It's to promote peace. On which hope? I think it was John and I think it was the sixth, but it could have been the fourth. And he could have been the seventh, so I'm not really sure. But he said, to promote peace, no, if you want peace, you have to, you have to work towards justice. So if you see injustice happening, there's not going to be peace in the world unless we are working for a just world. Everyone is called to work towards, towards human dignity, to work towards bringing peace into the world. This is not something that just, you know, this certain people are called to do. All of us as Christians, and you, even as young as you feel you are, you are called to that. And everyone does it in their own capacity. Well, I don't, go, I don't have to go in and help out other people. The government should do that. But that is not what we are being called to do. Even though we are still being called to pay taxes. You know, I'm not saying that you're going to replace one with the other. But you can if you do, if you donate to something, I mean, you can have some taxes deducted from you, but that's not the point of my talk. Um, so, in those Christian communities, that's why Paul wrote, and they will know we are Christians by the love that we have for each other, because we take care of each other. And that's what Jesus is calling us to do, to take care of others who cannot take care of themselves, to look for the most vulnerable, and to always, every time that you need someone, to think of that person as a child of God. So, what did you think of this talk? It was really good. Yeah, I, I thought so too. If you enjoyed this video, please do like if you want to see more. Please and make sure you come next week to Night <laughs> Team. And that would, we would really appreciate it. If you want to see more of our content, please subscribe and hit the bell to be notified on our latest episode. So until next time, we'll see y'all later. Bye.